Good evening, I'm Superintendent Chris Koska, and it's my privilege to welcome you to the 2020 Novato Inspirational Student Achievement Awards. Each year, the Novato Unified School District partners with the Novato Chamber of Commerce to present these awards to students who, throughout their school years, have demonstrated the six C's of the Novato Unified School District's graduate profile. Those include collaboration, communication, critical thinking, cultural competence, character, and being conscientious learners. Every school in the Nevada Unified School District honors two students from 5th, 8th, and 12th grade to receive these important honors, and it's my privilege to welcome you here tonight. And now I'd like to present the 2020 NISA Award recipients. Hi everyone, my name is Tenia Chima and I am the principal at Loma Verde Elementary School. Today I am so excited to be able to tell you a little bit about two of our amazing students who are receiving the NISA Award. First up, we have Alexandra Ruby Reyes Arguello. Ruby's fierce grit and determination in challenging herself continuously makes her a model of a conscientious learner. Ruby sets academic goals and works hard, never giving up, seeking help when needed, and sharing her excitement of learning with others. Ruby balances this quest for academic rigor while maintaining balance with her family commitments and extracurricular activities, including soccer, dance, odyssey of the mind, and being a student leader in organizing Loma Verde's talent show. Congratulations, Ruby. Next up, we have an amazing student named Drew Shelton. Drew has an exuberant character. He always has a positive attitude and approach to learning and life. He has a growth mindset view of the world around him, and if he doesn't understand something, he uses the word yet. Drew has a lot of integrity, is respectful to others, and has a kindness that he shares with everyone. In addition to possessing a strong character, Drew is an amazing collaborator. He's always working towards team success. He's great at sharing his own ideas as well as listening to others in his group. He's gifted in managing conflicts. This year he had training with Phoebe Smith in restorative practices as well. Drew is a critical thinker. He connects his learning to other subjects and into the real world. Congratulations, Drew, and thank you very much. Hi, I'm Jennifer Dudley, and I'm honored to present this year's NISA recipients for Lou Sutton Elementary. First, Isabella Bella Sharp. Bella demonstrates cultural competence, character, and collaboration in her leadership role as class representative on this year's student council. As a student council member, Bella is a role model for other students as she works with her peers to contribute positively to the community. For example, she collaborated with classmates to, rec to organize a Lou Sutton food drive and donate all the collected items to North Marin Community Services. In addition to these three C's, Bella also exhibits being a communicator in her leadership role as student conflict manager. In this role, Bella often engages in difficult conversations during recess to help other students communicate with each other and resolve conflicts. Congratulations, Bella, we are so proud of you. Our next recipient is Dahlia Garcia Estrada. Dahlia, too, is an amazing individual. She has admirable determination and a solid work ethic, which enhances her exemplary character and mature cultural competence. She always puts her best self out there in the world, trying to do positive things for herself and those around her. She never shies away from doing what is right, even if the decision isn't popular among her peers. She understands that being compassionate, empathetic, and consistent in character to all people is important, and we truly admire Dahlia for her commitment to being the best version of herself and her encouragement to others for being upstanding citizens as well. Not only is Dahlia committed to self-success, she wants her classmates to experience success as well. She is willing to help others as needed, give sound advice when it is asked for, and she is an excellent learner. Dahlia is absolutely a Novato inspirational student. Congratulations to both of you. We are so proud of you. Good evening, NUSD. Thank you for taking time to honor our students this school year. My name is Melissa Diaz, and I'm the principal of Linwood Elementary School. On behalf of Linwood, I would like to present our 2020 NISA Award recipients. First, I would like to present Zulema Hernandez. Zuli is a hardworking and conscientious learner who often steps up to challenges but never hesitates to ask for help. 
She is also a talented artist and loves to dance. Zuli is always willing to help out around school and she especially enjoys helping out in the front office whenever possible. Zulema's leadership shines in her ability to communicate well. She believes in herself and is able to advocate, advocate for other students as well. Congratulations, Zuli. Linwood's second NISA recipient is Andres Guzman. Andres demonstrates character through his work effort and is always willing to hit the ground running in every situation. He demonstrates leadership through his work as a tech teammate at Linwood and is always willing to help others, often going out of his way to ensure everyone who needs help is supported. When Andres is faced with a challenging situation, he will skillfully unpack it until a solution arises, but he's also willing to ask for help and support when needed. Congratulations, Andres. Linwood is proud to have both Zulema and Andres receive the 2020 NISA Award. We wish them the best of luck in the future. Hello, I would like to acknowledge Kylie Intera Tavonsky as this year's recipient of the Novato Inspirational Student Achievement Award from Olive School. Kylie consistently takes action to contribute to the Olive School community through her participation in student council, playground peacekeeping, and the Olive video crew. She is an articulate, creative problem solver. Concerned about her classmates at the beginning of our school year, she wrote and presented the student body a short essay on possible solutions for students who are making poor choices. Whether it's in a classroom book club or playing the drums for the talent show, Kylie is an interactive learner who shows her leadership in group situations by taking the initiative to organize interactions with her peers in a positive way. Again, congratulations, Kylie. You are an excellent representative of all the qualities of our NUSD graduate profile. I'm gonna talk about Landry Hutchins, who's in my class at Olive. He is cooperative. He can work with anyone, wants his classmates to succeed all the time. He's a critical thinker. Uh, he's intelligent and insightful and loves getting lost in a good book. He's a conscientious learner. He is hardworking, always gives 100%. Um, he has that inner drive that pushes him to keep a growth mindset and his character. His character is the best. Um, he's kind and honest and truly cares about the well-being of those around him. I'm so proud of him and I can't wait to see what he does in the future. Good evening, uh, Board of Trustees and Superintendent Chris Kaska, parents and families and students. I am Dana Sedan, I'm the principal at Pleasant Valley Elementary School, and I am here today to announce the NISA Awards for Pleasant Valley. And I'm so excited to do so, we had some wonderful candidates. So um, the first recipient is Madison Bartlett. So congratulations to Madison Bartlett. Um, her teacher is Liz Nelson, and this is what Liz wrote. Um, Madison is a highly motivated girl who works hard and is eager to learn. She is a deep thinker who is open to old and new ideas. Madison works well in every group, participates in all collaborative projects with excitement and pride. Madison always goes the extra mile to check for understanding, and she's not afraid to ask questions when she needs clarification. Congratulations to Madison. The second recipient is Gabriel Garcia Rodriguez, also known as Yair, and he is in Demore Herrera's class. And this is what we say about Gabriel. Gabriel is the perfect example of a 21st century learner and a model of a student who uses the six C's. He's a critical thinker, he's eager to learn, he consistently dives into all of his studies no matter what subject it is. He questions what is taught, he, what he researches, and continues to think about the material long after it's complete. Gabriel never gives up on any concept. He will sit with a math concept and repeatedly focus on, focus on it until he has a deeper understanding and feels its master. His success is not because the subject at hand is easy for him. It's due to his continued perseverance. Uh, Mrs. Herrera says that she's never had a student work harder than he does and with such enthusiasm. He goes above and beyond in all that he does, grappling with the text in his head over and over. Congratulations to Gabriel and to Madison for receiving the NISA Award for Pleasant Valley Elementary School. Hi, I'm Vanessa Coleman. I'm a fifth grade teacher at Rancho Elementary School. And today I'd like to nominate Gael Sanchez Ocon for the Novato Inspirational Student Award. Gael stands out among peers as a conscientious learner. He works hard on his goals and manages his time in order to accomplish them. 
He is a constant model of integrity and honesty, even in tough situations. Gael is a responsible team member and an asset to any group. He is able to delegate roles to others to help highlight their strengths and exemplifies positive work ethic and focus while working. Gael inspires others every day. And today I'd like to recognize Rocklin Coyle as an inspirational student here in Novato. Rocklin's character and cultural competence make her stand out as a young leader. She is aware of the many perspectives that make up our world and values and respects others in their uniqueness. Rockland listens actively and communicates clearly with peers. Not only is she a strong self-advocate, she will also speak up for others in need. Rockland is a hard worker who embraces challenges with a growth mindset. She is focused on her goals and accomplishes great things through determination and dedication. Rockland is inspirational to both the students and adults around her. Hello trustees, Nevada Unified School District and our community here in Nevada. My name is Amanda Langford. I'm the principal at San Ramon Elementary School and I am pleased to introduce to you our NISA awards for this year. They are Katarina Fedorov and Finnegan Bennell. Katarina Fedorov is kind to others and is incredibly positive always. Her smile warms everyone's heart. She is a good friend with an infectious laugh that will help put a smile on everyone's face. She is positive and respected by her peers, helpful and strives to do her best every day. Katarina has always come to school every day ready to work. She cares about other students and collaborates well when working in groups. Katarina is a team player. She listens to what her group members have to say respectfully and will interject her own ideas and opinions while maintaining a positive attitude contributing using her own strengths to the success of the task. Katarina is a conscientious learner. She is curious, always thinking and asking questions about what is being taught in the classroom. She has a positive attitude and perseveres even when things are difficult. She is a pleasure to work with and always tries her best. Finnegan Bennell, known at school as Finney, is an amazing kid. He always helps others in need, both in the classroom and on the playground. He has a helping hand, a listening ear, and a caring heart. He often puts his concern for others first, and he would quickly pick up on other students' discomfort and concern and show them a strong moral compass trying to help his peers find a solution or even seeking an adult when needed. Finney is a polite and respectful young man. Over the years at San Ramon, Finney has been described as always showing responsibility, conscientiousness, kindness, trustworthiness, and a contagious can-do attitude. He is a friend, team player, and treats everyone he has with respect. He has a great work ethic and collaborates well with other students in the classroom. Hello trustees and Novato community. My name is Steve Hospitar. I am the proud principal of Hamilton K-8 School. It is my honor to introduce the four NISA award recipients for the 2019-2020 school year. With so many outstanding students at Hamilton School, it is difficult to choose just four. A NISA award recipient is Diego. Diego demonstrates an interest, awareness, and understanding of multiple cultures beyond his years. He always actively listens and is eager to participate in class, even in difficult conversations. Diego applies critical thinking skills across the subjects and recognizes and applies multiple ways of solving problems. He's self-motivated with a strong desire to learn and achieve. Diego embodies strong character. He is kind, giving, and supportive of others. Congratulations, Diego. Ava embraces challenges with a growth mindset and a positive attitude. She possesses strong values, models integrity, honesty, and grit every day. She is able to synthesize new information, apply problem-solving skills, and generate creative solutions at the highest level. Ava has a gift for collaborating with students who have challenges. Her warm and supportive personality contribute to the learning environment for all. Congratulations, Ava. In eighth grade, our first recipient is Ikeka. Ikeka has worked very hard to transform himself into a successful student and an outstanding athlete. He has learned to push himself and step outside his comfort zone. 
Ikeka can be counted on to contribute to a positive classroom culture. He comes to the class ready to learn and is reflective and responsive to learning and feedback. Congratulations, Ikeka. Our second eighth grade recipient is Francesca. Francesca carries a spirit that is infectious. She builds bridges in her school community through participating in school events, sports, leadership, and service opportunities. Francesca stands out as a leader in her ability to communicate and inspire others. She's a strong collaborator who selflessly helps others who may be struggling. Francesca is a joy to be around. Congratulations, Francesca. Congratulations to all four NISA Award recipients for the 2019-2020 school year. I'm Debbie Richardson, and I'm the proud principal of San Jose Middle School. I'm here to present this evening the NISA Award winners from San Jose Middle School for 2020. You know, when you ask teachers to talk about their students, they often have a lot to say. And when I asked for feedback for these particular awards, I'm going to have to tell you that there was just an insistence on these two students as being the best representatives of the graduate profile from our school. Our first winner is Nithya Sunku, and she was nominated by Ms. Baraban, and her nomination was seconded by other teachers. Ms. Baraban wrote about her uh, that she is a conscientious learner and that she completely exemplifies a growth mindset. And what that means is that she is very reflective. She understands her strengths and areas where she needs to improve and works hard and sets goals to improve in those areas. She loves to learn and she really works to get better all the time. Nithya is also very culturally competent and very deliberate in her efforts to understand other viewpoints from people who come from different backgrounds than her own. She is respectful and asks careful questions to understand where other people are coming from. San Jose is very happy to honor Nithya Sunku with this year's NISA award. Our second winner is Casey Hilton, who was nominated by her drama teacher, Ms. Fisher, but the nomination was seconded by other teachers. Ms. Fisher wrote about her that she is an amazing collaborator. She looks at the whole class as her team and she, her positive and inclusive energy really spreads through the classroom. She is a leader in this area. She's extremely trustworthy and exhibits a very high level of character and she's dependable. Um, she actually is quite a leader in this area. Casey is also a very conscientious learner. She challenges herself to grow and get better. She looks at projects as opportunities to advance her skills and talents. Again, we are proud to recognize Casey Hilton as a NISA award winner this year. Good evening, my name is Jeff Wallace, principal of Sinaloa Middle School. I'm here to present our NISA award winners. First is Dulce Godinez Cajon. In the words of Ms. McGurk, Dulce is one of the kindest, most talented and humble students we have had the pleasure to work with at Sinaloa. She always does her best work. Excellence is her standard. She continually helps other students and makes an effort to include others. She's extremely thoughtful in sharing her own perspective and demonstrating empathy towards others. Her con contributions to our class are awesome. Her work is always both brilliant and beautiful. Thank you for being a role model to us all. Our second winner is Maximus Yu. In the words of Ms. Tubach, this student is an out-of-the-box thinker. He is constantly asking how he can make projects his own and how to improve those projects and ideas. Additionally, he consistently shows he is kind and considerate of others. He never fails to leave my classroom without wishing me a good day. He maintains a positive attitude even when things do not go his way. He is a true gem. Congratulations to both of our winners and thank you for being great Sinaloa Spartans. My name is Kessa Early and I'm the principal of Hill Education Center. And tonight I have the honor to recognize one of our seniors, DJ Strayton. She is currently a senior at Marin Oaks High School and DJ is described as having a good head on her shoulders. In addition to her success as a student, she has also served on multiple school committees, including our school board meetings. Outside of school, DJ is known for her gaming talent. She plays, competes, and even designs games. But most important, DJ believes that all people should be treated fairly and she practices what she preaches. DJ Straighten is a true inspiration and she has a promising future. Congratulations, DJ. The next student that I have the honor to recognize is also a Marin Oak senior and her name is Chloe Purcell. Chloe Purcell is an exceedingly strong individual. 
someone who stands against injustice and speaks up for the marginalized. And yet, as passionate as she is, there's a gentleness about her as well, a rare combination. Chloe is forging her own way in this world, a difficult task at any age, with a kindness and a sensitivity towards others, as well as an academic record of 4.0, Chloe models the way for us all. Congratulations, Chloe. I will now be recognizing seniors from Nova Independent Study. First, we have Marissa Gumpel. Marissa is one who excels in many areas. She produces top quality work in all of her academic endeavors. She's a gifted artist and is an accomplished gymnast. She has a deep appreciation for all cultures, loves learning foreign languages, and hopes to broaden her experiences by traveling the world. Dedicated, compassionate, bestowed with many talents, Marissa has the qualities of being a recipient of this year's NISA Award. Congratulations, Marissa. Our final senior being recognized this evening is Nova senior, Noah Erickson. By forging one's own path, seeking one's own truth, and living a life unapologetically, Noah, in every sense of the word, is an inspiring individual. Along with being a proud member of the trans community, Noah is a dedicated, self-motivated learner, worked a part-time job after school, and played on the men's volleyball team at NHS. Noah plans to study psychology while attending Prescott College in Arizona. We are so proud of you. Congratulations, Noah. Good evening. I'm Mark Brewer, the principal at Novato High School. It's my pleasure this evening to introduce two outstanding students for the NISA Awards who are representing Novato High School. The first is Sage Patel. Sage is an outstanding student. She participated in advanced placement classes along with soccer and other sports programs during her time here at Novato High School. She completed her time here with a cumulative GPA of 4.3 and will be attending the University of California, Santa Barbara next year at college. The next student is Natalyn Escobar. Natalyn participated in advanced placement courses as well as the AVID program. She is another outstanding representative. She completed high school with a cumulative GPA of 4.1 and she plans on attending Cal Berkeley in the fall. Congratulations to both students. They are great representatives of Novato High School and the Hornet tradition. Greetings, Novato Unified School District. My name is Mark Sims. I'm principal at San Marin High School here to share a little bit about Andrea Martinez Ruiz, uh, one of our recognized NISA award winners for the 2019-2020 school year. Uh, a few things uh, regarding conscientious learner, which stand out in our minds for Andrea and her character. Um, so one of the things to talk about regarding Andrea is her 590 hours and still counting of community service. She has been an active member of our community supporting others uh, and continues to do so to this day. On campus, she is a tremendous communicator and a very conscientious learner. She has great adult relationships, always advocating for others and for herself and her education. And that has led her to being recognized by Dominican University. She has earned a scholarship to attend Dominican in the fall, where she will be studying occupational therapy on, in a hands-on setting. So we're very proud of Andrea. Congratulations to you uh, and to all of the winners in Novato Unified School District. And I'm here to share a few uh, sentences about Howard Fry, or Howie, as we know him here at San Marin, one of our NISA Award recipients. So Howie um, has an infectious personality. He is a big personality on campus, uh, always talking to other students, talking to adults. And that's one of the things that we notice about his ability to collaborate with adults. He is mature beyond his years and has really developed and fostered some positive relationships with those of us on campus. As a conscientious learner, he has gone above and beyond. He has served as a teaching assistant in our EL classes, supporting one of our neediest groups. And this has led him to pursue uh, the possibility of earning his teaching credential, hopefully coming back to San Marin, as well as teaching uh, overseas. So congratulations to Howie and all of our NISA award winners. Hello students from Novato Unified School District. Coy Smith here from the Novato Chamber of Commerce congratulating you on being a NISA winner. We could not be happy for you for meeting your six C's and all the compliments you have done over the years at your school. So congratulations, the Chamber is excited and always proud to help sponsor this event with the school district. And we look forward to seeing you in person next year. Hi, I'm Denise Athas, the mayor of the city of Novato. And on behalf of the city council and the city, 
we really want to congratulate you students on accomplishing the six C's of the Novato Unified School District graduate profile. Collaboration, communication, critical thinking, conscientious learning, cultural competence and character. That's a huge achievement that you've just done and you should be very proud of yourselves. I can tell you from the heart that we're proud of you, Novato proud. Please join me in congratulating these students on their tremendous achievement of demonstrating the six C's of Nevada Unified School District's graduate profile. On behalf of myself and the Board of Trustees, congratulations. We are all very proud of you.